Okay, my YouTube watchers, I wanted to show you an experience that I had when I was working at the moment, going to the next customer. It started raining and snowing the same time, this terrible, horrible weather that just changed in minutes as I'm getting to my next customer. And you're going to see here in the video how I start slipping when I'm going up a mountain, how somebody came out of their hearts to help me to at least to pull me up to the top that it was about 150 feet distance and then as I drove down the street to get back to my house because I refused to go to anybody else it was so slippery the roads and so dangerous and my car was zigzagging left and right so I had to find uh, the common piece in my terrifying moments that I'm going down this road and just just scared just totally scared because I've never been in a situation like this before. I come from Florida and move into West Virginia with my wife here. And and look at the situation. It's just horrible. So this is what you start seeing as I start slipping up the road. And you could hear me talking that my car is, is stalling on me. And, and I'm just slipping. I'm going slower and slower. So I decide to get off the road. Okay, after I stop for a moment, I get my grip, I let cars pass by, and then I start watching behind me again. It looks a little safe that I don't have to be causing traffic to anybody or being unsafe to myself or to anybody else that's coming up the road. So after this car passes, then I have enough space that I could continue behind him and retry to get back on the road. But as you see, I'm slipping left and right, so I couldn't do anything else. So I have this gentleman that he stopped with his truck and offered his services to help me. So I, he's pulling me up the hill, and then this uh, there's a, a pickup, a blue pickup right in front of him. So he's, the guy is slipping like crazy also, trying to get up there and forcing his uh, truck to get up the hill. And so the, the truck that's helping me out, he starts going right beside him. And dangerously, this guy in the blue pickup, as you see, he has his brakes on. But as he, if we're trying to pass him, he starts trying to pat, uh, try to get up and force himself up the hill. As he sees me, sees me and this guy in the truck trying to help me going up the hill. And now causing danger, not only for himself, but for us. So I start honking at him right here to see. And the guy starts going faster and faster. And how crazy people could be in a dangerous situation like this. But the guy just kept on slowly off the road and then the other cars that was coming behind us, they slowed down to let us get up this hill. Then it was about almost two to three hundred feet distance that I had to climb up. So when he realized it was all straight, this guy parked in, in, in a certain area that I could start moving without his assistance. And we just came out and give hands and God bless to each other because some people are still decent out there. Now in this part, this man is worried to see if I would have gotten on a safe part that I could start moving my vehicle and I started asking him, do you want us to help you too to pull your car or to get you up the hill as other people?
that part so now I'm putting up my chain and now at this back. moment I know that I could go up safely and continue the road and then I find the turn I start slipping here and getting straight to my house because I decided just to go home and I'm about a mile away as I start driving up to here and I'm just fear for my life and right down this road we just passed a car I believe that he was on he was off the road so I couldn't do nothing for him because I can't really pull anybody because I got a small truck I got a Ford Transit connected that those are really not good trucks to really roll on the snowy places so I'm going down the road that is about still half a mile away from my home going as slow as I can and slipping left and right and I'm just terrified I'm just completely terrified my heart is beating I mean I'm scared that I'm gonna crash into somebody or somebody's gonna crash into me or I just destroy my car and this is the vehicle that I think I we, somebody I just passed somebody. that he I was stuck in the ditch right there. I am. I already had a few close, close calls slipping off the road. You guys just noticed it when I made the turn. Okay, now my tires are still slipping. My turn is coming up. There's a big parking lot of a karate uh, that's on the turn of where I live. If I can't make it, at least I'll try to put it in that parking lot. Exactly. So I'm going up the hill now. Okay. Thank the Lord that I could. I am not going to stop on the stop sign. I'm going to see if I have enough momentum to reach up the hill, this little hill. There we okay, I'm good right here. I hope you share my scaredness. This is Stephen Guggen signing off.